Hello and welcome to LVW's TV. I know it's a little bit basic here. I do see that. Um, um, it's going to increase as as I start doing this. I'll be putting posters behind me and stuff like that. Anyway, what's LVW's TV about? What well, is about you guys? It's about the fact that we're in this situation where we could be isolated for 12, 13, 14, even 16 weeks. In this situation, there are people out there, some heroes that we need to talk about. Now the first one is a gentleman called Li Wing Lang. I'll just put an image up. This is the gentleman that uh, in China tried to uh, get the message out very soon and he was hushed up. Now unfortunately, eventually he did succumb to the illness. We're all fighting at the moment. You'll notice I'm trying not to say what the illness is. That'll be a theme of the program. Let's not say what it is. But Li Wing Wen Lang is a uh, today's hero um, and probably tomorrow's and so on because he tried really hard and helped lots of people when when everyone else is trying to hush him up let's talk about other heroes okay here and now on the screen will be all the people that have contacted me or have been suggested and they work in the hospital uh, medical industries at the moment so if you look on your screen now these are our everyday heroes <laughs> Okay, hello, welcome back. Right, there's some good good photos on there, wasn't there? Now, if you want to nominate anyone, for air, if they work in any area that's really going above and beyond, um, tomorrow we're going to focus on retail. But there's also the trucking industry, the police, there's the soldiers coming into it. The, we go back to the hospital, there's so many sections there, the hospices and uh, the, the paramedics and, and all the different things. Uh, if you want to recommend uh, or, or, or suggest someone, then you just contact us. You can do it through Facebook, just send us a person's name and an image, or you can come to uh, LVWs, that's LVW, ws.tv at gmail.com and then just uh, send us uh, an image and who they are we don't care where they're from and as long as they're doing a good job and helping everyone please let us know because these are heroes now everyone so um i want to say a big hello to or sympathize with uh, two countries today and it will be two countries each day today we're sympathizing with china that seems to be the the logical one or that we should sympathize they've been fighting this for a long time and of course um, Italy. So you'll notice there's two flags or one flag. I'll point however we do it. There's some flags somewhere saying hello and uh, we're, uh, you know, sad they're having to go through this like we are. Uh, next, Lex, Lex, here's a good one. So what can you do? What can you do at the moment? You're stuck at home. So I'm going to suggest a few things, okay? There is uh, a film. It's a film called Blinded by the Light. It's just come out on Amazon Prime. This is a film based around a true story of a gentleman that uh, fell in love, an unlikely person actually, that fell in love with Bruce Springsteen music and how it influenced him. And if you look in, once you watch the film, you look into what actually happened in his life. He went into the field that he was fighting to go into in the film. Um, it is really, really funny. It's directed by the same lady that directed Bend It Like Beckham and it's back on form. She has done a few big films anyway, but this one is brilliant, brilliant. The soundtrack uh, um, from Bruce Springsteen is, is amazing. Amazing. But if you've got Amazon Prime, it's there, it's free, just watch it. It's a great two hours, you, you'll really enjoy it. Um, next, next, let's talk about music. You'll notice right next to me here, I've got Hot, Hot Fuzz, this is the Killers. Well, they've said now that all the festivals are cancelled all around the world, uh, uh, Glastonbury as well, having just put up quite a big... Uh, Quite a good lineup actually with AJ Tracy and Kendrick Lamar and, and people like that appearing. But anyway, let's go through. If you are bored, then of course, why don't you revisit the Killers? The Hot Fuss album is worth playing very loud. Have we noticed what the Italians have been doing on the balconies? They've been playing music and firing it across the street to other people. Maybe we can do that with some Hot Fuzz. Just open your windows, blast it out loud. If someone complains, well, you know, they complain, don't they? All right. Um, so let's have a look here. Um, ah. Ah, <laughs> you'll notice I'm looking down. So, I've got a list here of what I need to go through. I know, it's very professional. This is just like a little screen that I can look at. 
Um, the next thing I want to talk to everyone about is if you've got kids in the house, there is a website called Oxford Owl. That's Oxford Owl, all one word, .co.uk. Now, this is a resource for free ebooks to help people, young people aged between 3 and 11. At the moment, there's hundreds and hundreds of books out there. Again, if anyone knows of any websites that we could uh, mention, I don't mean the normal ones, but the, the, the ones, or the rude ones either, but the ones that can actually help families with children, then let me know, please, all right? Um, so, uh, what else? Ah, oh, so I've done a film done a film and I've also, also I've pushed Amazon which I've, I've not got no allegiance to TV series if you are looking for a TV series there's one called Manhunt the Uni Bomber it's on Netflix now this stars uh, Paul Bettany as the Uni Bomber uh, Paul Bettany is Vision in the uh, Avengers universe and he's fantastic he's been in loads of film you'll recognize him now also it stars Sam Worthington he is the hero from the Avatar movie and I presume he'll be coming up for the Avatar sequels when they venture out Sam Worthington plays an FBI agent that's called in and he uses linguistic to try and help chase the Unibomber. Um, actually, people in the UK might not be familiar with the Unibomber. Uh, the, it's called a Unibomber because the U in the Uni as such, or the Una, uh, is for universities, the R is for airports, and of course the bomber is because they bombed it. It was a, a reign of 17 years in America. I don't quite know why us, us in the UK aren't that aware of it. Um, but this is a, a fictionalised, dramatised, shall we say, version of what happened. And, and it's great. There's, there's, there's a few episodes and it builds up over the episodes and it's really, really good. So the next thing I want to talk about is, I don't know if the people in the, uh, the, the front line, the NHS staff, council workers and stuff like that are aware, but there are several companies now starting to offer free drinks and free food and stuff like that. So Pret and Manja, I think, have put up a thing saying that um, NHS and similar get free drinks and 50% off food. You'll have to double check that online and all that, but um, that's good if you're in an area that, that that benefits. McDonald's, I believe, is also offering for uh, council workers, NHS staff and similar. And as are Domino's, they might be worth checking. Again, if you know of any other company that's doing anything fantastic for people on the front line, please let me know so I can pass it out there so they can go and look into it and take advantage of this. Some of them are working very, very long hours and at the end of a shift, it might be nice just for them to go and get a pizza and then go home to their families. Um, the So we've done everything. Here's something for the children. If you want to teach your children something fun, if you just want to take up half hour each day, there's an 80s song called Superman and in it you have to brush your hair, you know the one, spray, match your man, all that sort of stuff. It's worth revisiting it, putting it in your front room TV, blast it out to your kids, teach them the move. We've got a little two-year-old doing it. If anything, it gets you to engage. You can do it, the whole family can do it, even the teens that are sitting there bored stiff. Just, just you know, each day, just put some music, play some music, let someone uh, choose what music and, and just have fun with it, you know. There's a lot of loud concerts, uh, live concerts even, but they can be loud if you want. There's lots of live concerts. That might be an avenue that if you want to put a fun on your uh, smile on your face, uh, if you want to put a smile on your face, that you might want to look at some concerts. Uh, yesterday, we revisited some ACDC. You want to look at the River Plate ACDC concert from a few years ago, and you sit there and you think, I'm not into ACDC, but trust me, if you write Thunderstruck and you put that clip up, it's going to be the one of the uh, best 10 minutes of your life. I say of your life, it's clearly not going to be, because if you've got married, had children, there's going to be better things. However, when you're stuck in your house not doing anything, it's, it's going to be uh, something worth visiting. Anyway, that's it for the today's show. It is just short, short and sweet. Each day is going to be the same. I'm hoping to get more and more pictures each day that I can send to fantastic people doing fantastic things um, like I say you can see lots of heroes here around me we've got John McClane here the ultimate hero but um, actually it's you guys uh, on the front line that are doing everything for us so that we stay safe during this time and I'd like to say thank you and I'm going to keep saying thank you until this is over bye <laughs>